The Tower Battles update is only two days away. Oh my gosh, what's gonna be in it? Well, I'm sure you want to get back to grinding for the update soon, so I'll answer that question quickly. The new towers coming include the Commander, Zed, and possibly Golden Mine Layer, but not likely this update. The new skins include the Fragger Grenadier, Tower of Battles Farm, Lifeguard Commander, Substitute Commander, Tower of Battles Farm, did I say Tower Battles Farm twice? My bad. Rock Band EDJ, Tower Battles Railgunner, and the Golden Scout Golden Ranger. This update will feature a new Battle Pass system which will allow you to unlock all these rewards. To progress, you earn tokens through playing matches, and you get extra tokens for playing the Tower Battles maps. Tower Battles maps have two modes, Normal and Nightmare. Normal will be, of course, easier, confirmed soloable with Armored Factory and Missile Trooper. For the more casual players, Nightmare will be a huge step up and will be the hardest game mode yet. The update will include a lobby rework as well that we have not seen before. If you want further depth on the upcoming content, you can check out John's live stream that I linked down in the pinned comment, but this video just serves as a quick bundle for you to gain information from. While you scroll down to watch those live streams, don't forget to like and subscribe on your way. Thank you to my channel members and thank you for watching. Peace out, have a good day. As I was about to upload this video, there was this Multiplier T leak along with this flood of enemies. And what I think is going to happen is that Multiplier T will multiply the enemy that is multiplied up until like half the map. Like it just floods the entire map with whatever it multiplied. That, that's my theory though. Anyways, peace out. Also, I forgot about this GDA skin for the Zed. Okay, peace out for real this time. Have a good day.